Hi, it's Dr. Katya. I'm not a real doctor, but I am a part-time animal psychic, and I'm also a hypochondriac. In my spare time, I like to use the information superhighway to diagnose and cure mysterious illnesses. You can count on me for 100% medically accurate information. So, my first patient is Glenn from Cohasset. Glenn is suffering from red scaly rashes on his legs and feet, painful burning sensation while he urinates, and is also having a hard time Ugh. defecating. Usually I go to WebMD, but today I'm feeling astrology.com has the answers, so let me just check this out really quick. I'm getting the sense that this is self-inflicted. The red rash is a, is a self-sabotaging metaphor. The burning while you pee is probably just separate. I would suggest there's a really good Mongolian folk singer. I put that on the CD player and I go take a nap and I just put a couple of cucumbers over my eyes and just douche with a big, like a hose of um, extra virgin olive oil and you just like let that just wash up your innards. <sighs> Next. Nancy from Tallahassee, Florida cannot find a boyfriend. That's not a medical problem, but I have an answer for you. If we go to buddhadharma.net, medicine is not an exact science. Spirituality is black and white. Then we can really find out what's at the core of what hurts us. What hurts you might feel good to me. Say I'm running through a cornfield in a sundress and I slip and fall on a corn cob and it goes straight up my asshole. You know, that might be a fun thing for me. And that might be a nightmare for you, but one man's trash is another man's treasure. The penguin from Batman said that. My next patient is Margaret, and she is suffering from a sore throat that has been recurring for the past three months. I don't know how to say this, but um, you're gonna die. Chad from Missouri. Dr. Kazia, I can't figure out a way to get my girlfriend to love me the way that I want to. I also have webbed feet. I believe it was Jodie Foster in the movie Contact who mentioned Occam's razor. The simplest explanation is often the best one. In this case, I would go for the more complicated one. Your problem is not your feet. Webbed feet are cool. You know, that's just the truth. Love is not the answer, not in this case. Have you ever been tested for scoliosis? What did you get on your SATs? These are all pointless questions. Sometimes science doesn't have the answers. When science fails us, where do we turn? Math. I want you to go to the Sheraton, I want you to get in that jacuzzi, cram those webbed feet in there, and I want you to look into the eyes of every Japanese tourist and say to them, water off a duck's back. Well folks, I'm Dr. Katya, and that was 100% medically accurate information for your approval. I hope you enjoyed yourself, and I hope that you continue to feel well within and without. God bless you. Warning, Katya's medical advice is for entertainment value only. Following some or any of her advice may result in nausea, fever, being forever alone, cold flashes, hot flashes, room temperature flashes, excessive flatulence, constipation, spontaneously bursting into song, spontaneously bursting into flames, unexpected pregnancy, or unwanted death. And don't forget to subscribe to WOW Presents. Hey Katya, WOW Legal here. Um, can you give me a call? We have a few concerns. <laughs>